for sure this edition of the Volvo Ocean Race is unfinished business for me. The crew is abandoning the ship. It's not just about getting around successfully this time. I want to win and I want to be a part of a winning team. This race forces you to grow. It forces you to mature. I'm only 27 years old, but I feel quite old already. I think my role on board as the young, hungry one who's happy to put their head down and go hard for days and days without sleep. There are so many tough moments in this race that you end up getting used to them. Have you broken it before? Yeah. Can you just tell me what place right I'll put it? Yeah, that's what I saw. It's stronger than that. Yeah. But if it has naturally led to it. How's that? Beautiful. Much better. How you respond to those tough moments is what this race is all about. It can be the difference between winning or losing, finishing in one piece, or not finishing at all. Setting up for a jab, it was quite windy, around 35, 40 knots, which makes it extremely hard to control the boat, and we wiped out, and that meant we, we broke the mainsail and, and some part of the rig. Hang on, head! When things get really tough, I just say to myself, the sun will rise again, just get through this night and it'll be easier. If you want to quit, quit tomorrow. Honestly, we're not where we want to be right now and, and we're in a tough position, we know that. But you gotta keep your head down and you gotta, you know, keep putting in the effort because it will change eventually. If you really work hard for something and you really believe in something, you can achieve it, especially in sport. One of the biggest moments for me was during the Atlantic crossing. We set a new 24-hour speed record for the Volvo Ocean Race by sailing 602 miles. That's exactly why you do the race. You just go for days and days and days for it. As fast as you can, there's no limits. These boats aren't designed to do those sorts of speeds. So it was pretty amazing and something that I'll remember forever. This is the last day, which is quite weird. When you go through what we're going through for the last nine months of this race, it's end up becoming quite close and then suddenly it all stops and we all go each way, which is quite weird. We finished in a way that we could be proud of and we could actually look ourselves in the eyes and say we've done everything we could. There was nothing left and there was nothing left to give. For me it's a challenge to go home. I enjoy being at the edge and I enjoy being at a spot where you need to deliver, otherwise there'll be consequences. What are we going to do now? What are we going to do now? What are you doing tomorrow? I don't know.